Hey guys, welcome back to Misha's Corner. So today we'll be making a Italian hot dog, just like we eat them up in New Jersey, but with a twist. So let's get started. All right, so I have my potatoes, peppers, and onions right here. We're gonna saute that up, smother it. We have I have my block cheese back there. I'm gonna make a tiny bit of a cheese sauce, and I have my sausage. You can use the brand you prefer. I use actually the cheapest one I found in the supermarket which is heritage <laughs> it's the long ones because that's what you need to you know fill out your bread I have some wheat rolls here you can use the roll you prefer but I'm using wheat you know that's what I found so yeah so let's get started with sauteing the vegetables all right so while my potatoes are sauteing I have my sausage here I put it out on aluminum foil I'm gonna pop it into a 375 oven until it's warmed all the way through and have some color my bread is back here because of the type of bread that I bought I decided to cut it down the middle just like this so I could get more filling in there however you also have the option to cut it on the side which I did for my second bun and yep so now we're gonna move on Alright, so I sauteed my potatoes in some um, butter, coconut oil, salt, pepper, and cayenne. Now you're just going to add your peppers and your onions down in here. The potatoes were cooking for about 10 minutes. I did it that way because I don't want my vegetables to break all the way down. I still want them to be, you know, kind of firm. So I got a head start on the potatoes first. And I'm going to cook this down and then... You can season this however you want, pretty much, but I'm keeping it pretty simple because, you know, that's a good Italian dog, simple. <laughs> Alright, in my pot here I have two tablespoons of butter. I'm going to add two tablespoons of flour and mix this in. You're going to cook your flour out for approximately one minute. Alright, so after one minute, you're going to add about a cup of milk, a little at a time, because you want to mix this in. Yes, I'm using a spatula all the time I do, and it mixes it out. So cold milk to hot through, no lumps. You're going to keep mixing this until it gets nice and thick. Season it how you want. However, I'm going to add some hot sauce, salt, pepper, and maybe some um, all-purpose seasoning. Alright, so now I'm going to add my salt down in here. Make sure you taste as you go. My pepper, not too much because we are adding hot sauce. I'm using this mango scotch bonnet hot sauce. Use whatever hot sauce you have on hand. I actually love Louisiana hot sauce in my macaroni and cheese cheese sauce. And this is pretty much the same concept. So, yeah, use what you have. Don't make a big deal. At this point, you want to taste it to make sure you're good before you add your cheese. Alright guys, so at this point, you want to cut your stove off. I'm adding sharp cheddar and mozzarella cheese down in here. Again, make sure your stove is completely off. <laughs> I'm just making a mess. I'm just making a mess. Mix this in, it's gonna become nice and cheesy. Mm -mm -mm. Look at that. We're gonna put this right down on that hot dog. Right down on there. All of it. Look at that. Mm -mm. Alright, guys, so I have my hot dog bun right here. I'm gonna put well, not my hot dog on my roll. You're going to put your dog right down in there just like that. Then you're going to take your cheese. You're going to take your cheese. Woo, yes, God. Mm. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Then you're going to take <laughs> then you're going to take your potatoes. And you want to what you want to pile it. You're going to pile the potatoes on. I already added ketchup to my roll. I'm still going to add ketchup on top of these potatoes. No one wants a dry Italian roll. I mean, not Italian hot dog. Look at me. I must really want that roll. I keep talking about it. I'm also going to wrap this up and put it right in the oven. 
so I could give y'all the full effect of wrapping it and slicing it right down the middle just like how the deli does it. It's a big dog, guys. Okay, guys, so <laughs> I added my ketchup. Now you're just going to finish this off with cheese. I know it's sloppy. I don't care. Pile it right on there. Look, I mean, come on. Come on. <laughs> All right, so now we're going to attempt to wrap this up. I'm going to pull this down here. We're going to put this. This part here, here, you're going to hold it tight and you're just going to roll it. Don't be afraid. Roll it. Roll it. I don't even know where the bottom or the top is at. Well, I can look through here. Oh, well, I'm good. I'm right on the top. Secure it. Secure the ends. And we're going to pop this right in the oven for a good 10, 15 minutes. And then, well, 10 minutes, then I'm going to slice it right down the middle, and that's it. All right, guys, so this has been in the oven for about 10, 12 minutes. Now I'm just going to cut it right down the middle. I'm using a serrated knife to make things easier on me. Woo! Look at that. First of all, okay, it's hot. I got to stop showing off. It's hot. Um... <laughs> You can see the cheese, the potatoes, the peppers, the ketchup, all of that. Let me try to get a close-up. It's hot, guys. There we go. Mm, mm, mm. Woo. So I hope you guys enjoyed this easy, simple Italian hot dog recipe. And I'll see you guys next time on my next video. Bye, guys.